You don't need to water it down No one else has the same story Stay with it, please. Hello there. It's going to be a collective reading for the collective. Thanks for clicking on, guys. Hello. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Down, 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 down. <laughs> Hello, everybody. This is a message. It doesn't matter what sign you are, no matter what sign you're dealing with. I hope that you're doing well. I hope that you're very healthy and you're doing great, okay? All right, thank you guys so much for the love, like, share, subscribes. You guys are amazing, okay? Without you, it wouldn't be possible. So I do love you. I love you. I love you. Hey, don't believe me? <laughs> Check again, baby. I said I love you, okay? I don't care who you are. You don't have to know me, okay, for me to love you, okay, baby? All right? All right, let's see what we got. Spirit, what is the messages from my dear collector? Let's see, Spirit, what we got going on. Mm. Okay. Bottom of the deck, hope. Okay, first card that came out is emotional. Emotional loss. Hmm. Somebody here. Somebody here is thinking about you. Somebody's in the Five of Cups. In the Five of Cups interjure. They're in the Five of Cups energy. Is that, can y'all see that collective? Yes, okay. At the bottom of the deck, somebody's hoping that they can mend this. Somebody's hoping. Spirit's saying, though, choose wisely. Okay? Choose wisely. All right? Somebody's going to come popping back up. Somebody that you probably ain't spoke to in a minute. Okay? Somebody you probably ain't talked to in a while. Okay? Somebody that you probably talked to last week. Somebody's feeling the loss of you. All right? This may have to do with somebody that tried to take something from you or somebody that tried to take your self-esteem, try to lower your self-esteem. Somebody here is going to learn today, all right, that your energy is, um, it's, uh, you can't compare it. it it's, it's irreplaceable. Whoever you are, collective, you're absolutely gorgeous, darling. You got a light in you, okay, that cannot be replaced. Whoever this is, this could be a friend. Let's see what we got going on here, spirit. One card, please. We got main female. Okay. This could be a main. This could be a female. All right. Or this could be um this could be a sister, a brother, a mom. There's a female here feeling some loss of some sort. There's a female that you've dealt with. Now you could be a male watching this, or you could be a female. You got a you got a you got a female here. Somebody that you dearly love, cared about, okay? They're feeling emotional loss. What's going on here while this person's feeling like this? What's going on with this? What, 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 what is, what's, if you could please, Spirit, give us a message, Spirit, please. Can you bless us with the message? What's what's going on with this main female? Even though they're feeling this emotional loss. Let me see, what, what, what is this? Pods. Looking for one, got two. Looking for one, got two. They try and want to tarnish your reputation. So whoever this person is, this female, okay, that's feeling this emotional loss, they're in the five of cups. Somebody's feeling their, their heart. Their heart hurts, okay? Inboxing your followers, trying to turn them against you. You could have a channel. You could have a platform. Doesn't matter. TikTok, Instagram, whatever it is, baby. Okay, there's a female that wants to tarnish your reputation because of the tension you're getting or whatever it is. All right, you have some type of light about you. This is like the star. The spirit saying choose wisely when it comes to the situation. Okay, somebody's gonna pop up out of nowhere. All right, I feel in a way, in, in a way, collective. This could be somebody that like sees you shining bright. They, they see you doing something, and they're jealous of it. Whatever it is, they, they got some kind of, uh, they got some kind of grudge against you, okay? Male or female. This could even be an ex-lover. Spirit, give me three cards, please. 
It doesn't even have to be followers. This could be somebody that doesn't even, you don't even have to have a platform. This could be somebody doing something with the uh, people at work or your family members, trying to turn them against you. People that just love you and adore you. They want them to see you in a different picture. There's a female here that's doing this. Regret. They're doing this. They're, they're acting out of this hasty energy. They're acting out like this because they miss you. So immature. I'll tell you for real. Who is this heifer? Who is it? Got Ace of Earth. Okay, it could be Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Okay. Somebody's having a lot of regrets because you were stable in their life. They're trying to manifest you back. Yeah, Eight of Swords at the bottom of the deck here. Somebody's very worried. There's a female here worried. So, there's someone here that's trying to, like, tarnish your reputation and stuff. Trying to turn people against you because they feel like if, you, if you, everybody else turns against you or your reputation's tarnished, if you're going to come back to them, you'll come back trying to make amends with them. This has something to do with their ego. Okay, then we have self-love here. Self-love. So this person's having regrets because this energy here, somebody sees you growing, manifesting, getting better, doing better. You might be having finances getting better for yourself or finances booming. You might have a following, okay? And then we have the self-love energy here because you're focused on your desires. You're focused on yourself. Somebody feels an emotional loss because of that. Is there someone that you may have put before yourself? If you did... Okay, you definitely made, yeah, look, somebody wants your forgiveness here. Their ego, their ego spiked out of control here. Somebody's ego, they have to have something their way. It has to be their way. So somebody feels like getting rid of people that actually love you, care about you, um, actually like treat you with respect. They feel if they get rid of all that or if they put you into a dark corner, you'll come running back to them. I don't know why this main female, I just don't trust them. Ah, uh, she. I don't. I don't know. I ain't. She, I ain't. I ain't. I ain't what? Okay. What's? Oh, Retta. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> My sister-in-law sent me some wine. You guys. <laughs> My son was sitting there holding it like mom. <laughs> Didn't know I was reading. All right. Let's see. Spirit, what's regrets here? What's what's the regrets they're having? Did I tell you I fought, uh, the Five of Cups is right here? I feel like it's the Five of Cups. If you see this person right here, look at this. Look, uh, you see this person right here? Emotional loss. Okay, somebody's having a lot of regrets for some shit that they've done. I feel that this person's having regrets, but I don't think they're remorseful. Why are they regretful? Six of Wands here. Like, I felt like this energy here, like you are the star. Something shines about you. Something's beautiful about you. And this person here is just, they're they're jealous of it. Whatever's going on in your life, whatever you got going on, this person's just upset. Somebody's upset here because you don't pay them any attention anymore. Maybe they did something shitty or shady to you, and maybe they thought this would bring you closer. So somebody's really hating here. I'm seeing this person here with a rose. Like they want to make some type of an apology because they feel the emotional loss now. They're in this energy where they're feeling the regret. Somebody feels um, some regret here because Five of Cups, somebody's like going back into some type of memories. Okay, maybe you and this person kicked it tough. Seven of Swords in the reverse here coming out by the Five of Cups in the upright. Somebody's feeling a lot of regret here. Some shit they did. Six of Swords at the bottom of the deck in the reverse. They want you to come back. If you're a guy, you have a female that's on your ass that wants you to come back. They're being very stubborn about it, though. So what they feel like they need to do is they need to tarnish all. They need to tarnish your reputation. They might be out there finding out people you might talk to, people might you might mingle with or talk with, telling them that you know you do this, you do that, you're insecure. Da da da. da. They want other people to feel confused or feel confused feelings towards you. If you are a female watching this, you have a female that's very envious of you. Okay, very envious of you. So much so that they might want to wear, they might try to buy the clothes you wear. They might see you on certain posts that you might have on your social media and they try to copy, copycat. I don't know why I'm hearing that for a female. Huh. Spirit, what's going on with this regrets? Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups. Whatever you caught on to is making somebody sad. You caught on to something and you walk the hell away. And they're feeling the emotional loss. Now, we got regret all over this, all over this table. You're irreplaceable. Somebody can't replace you. 
If they want to put out five or six, seven, nine friends next to them, they do not compare to you. If they want to put out five, six, seven lovers next to them, they cannot compare to you. Uh -uh. Nope. There is no comparison here. Somebody's very emotional right now. Somebody's doing a lot of crying. With this emotional loss and this five of cups here, and they want to tarnish your reputation, someone's doing this out of anger, um, out of envy, anger. Somebody's suffering in some type of silence. They feel crappy for what they did. Does this person have remorse with this Eight of Cups here? Does this person walk away? The higher in the reverse. No, they do not. There really isn't truly no loyalty. I feel like this person just knows that they can't size up to you. Or they can't have anybody that... Whoever that this person has around them, they try to make them into you. Or they try to make you jealous in some way. This person's not loyal. This higher fit in the reverse. Could be done with the Taurus. Could be done with the, um, a water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um, there's a lot of emotions going on around here. And I don't think this person really knows how to deal with it. Page of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck in the reverse. They're not very stable. They're, they're not stable in the mental This is probably somebody like you guys will go out or something and they would have you put up for drinks. They'd act like as if they had a lot of money or something or they'd get you back. Somebody here might owe you something. Very envious female here, you guys. I'm feeling feminine energy. Could be a male. Spirit, what's this Ace of Earth here? The Ten of Pentacles. Whatever you're doing is going to bring you a lot of prosperity. It's going to bring you a lot of joy. You're very powerful at this time with the star energy here. The spirit, I don't know why, spirit's giving a warning. Choose wisely because this person's not... The, can I say it nice? They're not mentally there. They. I think they just see you doing something. You're successing, you're successful at something, or you're becoming successful, or you're able to go after your goals or what it is you want, and they don't have that same drive. So when they were like around you or whatnot, you might feel a bit of drainage around this person. They might try to be the center of attention with this earth energy here and then this ten of pentacles here. Somebody wants whatever it is that you have. Somebody wants to be you. Somebody wants to have what it is that you what it is that you have. Spirit, Ace of Earth here. Ace of Earth. The King of Cups. Somebody sees you're very mature. Four, four of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Somebody's sick too. Somebody has a lot of... Um, somebody's got an illness. Five of Pentacles here. Somebody feels left out. And the, and the, and the hate... And the hate and this energy that they're trying to like mask it's like making them ill what kind of shit is this hmm spirit this king of cups here what is this page of cups in the reverse so you were dealing with somebody that wasn't even like on your level i felt the energy like they're not mentally you know um Somebody wants to be you. Somebody wants to be you or they want to be the people around you. Look, we got the Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck in the reverse here. The Queen of Cups is in the upright. I don't know. I feel like this is somebody, this main female here. They're very, um, they're unavailable emotionally. They're unavailable emotionally. They're not very caring. Okay. They can play that role all they want. But since you walked away or if this person walked away from you, they regret that shit. They regret it. It's like when you got this person out of your energy, I don't care who left who. However it happened, you became better. Yeah, nine of cups in the reverse. You became better. So whatever manipulative tactics they were trying to do to you while they were around you, or if this person's still around you, whatever they're doing, wish is not being fulfilled. Prayers are not being whatever they prayed for, or whatever they had hoped for a downfall. It's not happening. All they're feeling is loss. 
empress at the bottom of the deck all they're feeling is lost you put a lot of work into yourself you put a lot of work into people around you you have this energy where you give people hope you give healing energy and this person just stays stuck on mad that's collective they stay mad <laughs> self-love that's what i'm saying whoever this is and whoever left who whatever the heck happened here since this person stepped away from your life or since you've had the space that you've needed, you have become better. Okay, things are becoming better for you. We have the world card here. Could be done with the Taurus, could be done with Aquarius, a Leo, or a Scorpio. But underneath the self-love with the world card, whatever connections you've wrapped up and let go of here at the bottom of the deck, we've got the Ten of Wands in the reverse. It has made you become better. It's like something's lifted off of you. Now you're in this energy, somebody's still trying to attack you in some way, shape, or form because they feel an emotional loss here. They're the ones stuck in regret. Seven of Swords here in the reverse. Whatever they're trying to do, whatever they're trying to be sneaky with, they got caught. Eight of Cups came up, and then we got the Hierophant in the reverse. When I asked, is this person uh, actually, like, how are they acting about this 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 emotionally? Are they, like, intending to be better or some, something I had asked at the beginning? And the Hierophant in the reverse came out. They're not loyal. They're not. They do a lot of switching around. I don't know why I'm getting that from that higher fan. I never got like disloyalty from the higher fan card before. Have I? I don't fucking know. Uh, I sh yeah, Page of Pentacles in the reverse. Not mentally there. It's over. Then we've got the Eight of Wands in the upright. It's over. This person's watching you from a distance. They're doing a lot of gossiping or whatnot. There's something here that's over. And they're acting as if it's not. The magician here in the upright, like I said, you're ambitious. You're very ambitious. You're going to have triumph. You're going to have success. You're going to have what it is that you want. And someone here does not like that. Someone here is supposed to, someone's wanting you to feel like you're in this emotional loss. And if you are the one in this emotional loss and you did some effed up tricky stuff to somebody and you got caught for it, this person, you deserved for this person to walk away. This could have been seven times this person's done this, ten times. Eight times, nine. Somebody's done so much betrayal here that if they came and said, I'm so sorry about what I've done, it wouldn't make no di it wouldn't make a difference. A sorry wouldn't, okay, I'll accept the apology, but I'm still moving on with my life. This is what this is. This page of cups here in the reverse with this king of cups in the upright, you were not on the same level emotionally. You know how to treat others, you know how to respect them accordingly, and someone here just plays a lot of mind games. It's like they make these offers or promises and things like that just to be conniving. It's all for self-fulfillment. It's not for anybody else to feel any type of way or fit. You know, we can't please everybody, but this person would make sure just to make sure they please themselves. They don't care who they hurt in the process. Mm. Spirit, self-love. Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. Somebody sees you very successful, very independent. Okay. And they just feel empty. They feel bottomless. Lovers at the bottom of the deck in the reverse. This could be a lover for some of you. Some of you, this could be a same-sex connection you were in. Okay? And some of you, this is a female. And you're a male. And this is a woman that's very upset. Having regrets because they see you stable and you're loving yourself now. And they feel an emotional loss here. Whatever they did here, Spirit clarified. Well, I feel this this lover's card in the reverse cheating. Spirit, clarify that Five of Cups, please. <clears throat> Three of Swords. Some of you, this is an ex. Same sex or some of you. Same sex. Woman, two women, two men. I ain't got nothing against any of that, so... Before anybody goes to, ah, no, I love the rainbow. I do. But whoever this is, they got a lot of regrets. Like, they're, 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 oof, oof. Strength card at the bottom of the deck could be done with a Leo. Somebody sees you so strong. They see you so strong, so much so that they feel like you're pure. And they feel the loss. This person's going to have you believe that they don't feel, that they, they, they're they not feeling anything. They feel it. Clarifying the five, of, the five of cups here. We got the three of swords. So whatever they were doing. Whatever.
whatever they got caught doing, it was a betrayal. Like I said, for some of you, before that card even came out, for some of you, this, this person's just grimy. I want to feel so sorry for them because it's emotional loss. I mean, this dude here, male or female, just looks like they looking in the distance. You know, they looking at the di they looking at something. They just like, God dang, like I messed up. You know, but at the same sense, this, the, the, there's a lot of betrayal here. Someone had no choice to walk away. Somebody here was disloyal as hell. Spirit, click for the higher front in the reverse. <sighs> Ice cream man's outside. Five of swords here, clarifying the hierophant in the reverse. <laughs> Do you guys hear that? <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Man, maybe spirit's trying to bring in a little bit of light and mood because th this uh, this this person, I, I want to feel sorry for him, but I don't. The moon card. They still got some secrets and things they're keeping away. Okay? They still got some secrets. I feel here also that somebody might be secretively suffering financially. They live beyond their means. I don't know where I'm getting that from. But clarifying the higher fit in the reverse with the five of swords. It's, it's just too much. You can't trust this person. Whatever question. I can't remember the exact question I asked when this eight of cups came out. But when it came out in the reverse, I said no. Because I could just feel it. Maybe about the card being in reverse, I could just feel it. And then clarifying the higher fit in the reverse, we got the five of swords. Clarifying the five of cups, we got the three of swords. Seven of swords in the reverse, the three of swords in the upright. That's ten swords right there. Somebody portrayed immensely. I'm trying to find words here. Somebody did a, a major betrayal, and, and this is not the first time. This is like, a, um, I saw, so, okay, yeah. All right, Spirit, are there any other messages? Mm. Collective, you deserve this independence. You deserve closing out this cycle to love yourself. You deserve this. Somebody can't think straight with this uh, page of pentacles in the reverse here. Somebody can't think straight seeing that this is closed out. Eight of wands here. They're watching you. I feel like this is the eight of wands and I know it means communication, but somebody's watching you online or something or trying to send some type of message because they see you in this independence. They see you in this star energy, just how beautiful you are. And then the choose wisely underneath. Now at the beginning of the reading, this came out. Now I'm seeing why choose wisely is up underneath that hope because Everything that shines is not glitter. Everything that's glitters is not gold. So be very careful with that. I will be very skeptical of this person. This female. Here, give me something for the main female. What is, can you give us a card for that? What's going on with this main female? New beginning. That's what they want. I'm also hearing that somebody sees you have... There's a female seeing you have new beginnings. And at the bottom of the deck, we got shattered. So there's a female here that's shattered by your new beginning. Okay, y'all, this could even be a friend. All right. Yeah, this could be a friend, somebody that you were friends with since you were children. This could be um, a female you have children with collective. Okay. Mm. Spirit, give me another for the main female here. Thank you. Opening up. Somebody feels shattered, they feel the emotional loss, and they want some type of opening dialogue here. They want to talk. With this Eight of Wands here, with the Nine of Swords, with the Nine of Pentacles, somebody really wants to travel towards you. They want to travel with you. Yeah. But it feels to me, look, just casual sex opened up. So maybe somebody's going to try to get you to open up by having or inviting you to like have some kind of, kind of you know, hookup session. Maybe that's the way of them opening up something for a new beginning here. However you want to have your new beginnings, have them the way you need to have them. Spirit, go ahead, um, please, and clarify the page of cups in reverse, the nine of cups in reverse. That's ten cups in the reverse. I'm also getting here that you are very um, emotionally stable, but you packed all that emotions by yourself. So you made this person extremely happy, and in return, they have some type of... Uh, 
whether this is a friendship or whatever, Spirit, clarify the page of cups in the reverse and nine of cups in the reverse. Commitment. Commitment. This is somebody you were probably trying to give a commitment to, but they weren't giving that back to you. I feel like you guys just weren't emotionally on the same page. Like emotions, emotion-wise, at the back of the deck, now we have lust. And then casual sex is here by the main female. So for some of you, not all, you might have been dealing with a friend that was, uh, if you're a female, if you're a woman, you might have had another woman that was really jealous of other people being around you because they sexually wanted to connect with you, okay, secretly, in a secret way, secretive, yeah. If you are a male, this person feels like um, a new beginning can ensue here with... Um, and have you open up about something or coming back together with some casual sex they're lusting after you i don't know why i'm getting i'm also getting here um look yeah see moving secretly so for some of you're a female there's a female that you think they want to get close to you in a different way but they did a lot of portraying shit because they like you if this is um, and you, you thought it, maybe this was like a best friendship or something, but somebody's extremely in regret here. They feel very much of an emotional loss. They wish they would have done something different, but they definitely still in this energy of trying to tarnish your reputation, people that you know or whatnot, they're trying to turn them against you. This person might be doing a lot of drinking. This main female might be doing a lot of drinking. This female here is whoever this is for. This female here wanted some type of commitment with you, but they couldn't meet you. They couldn't meet you there. The Nine of Cups in the reverse with the Page of Cups in the reverse kept playing games here. Maybe you were in some type of commitment and they were wishing and hoping that you wouldn't be in a commitment with a man. Okay, Spirit, give me something for that commitment energy with the Nine of Cups in the reverse and the Page of Cups in the reverse. This might sound all over the place, but this is, there's, yeah, look, rejection. Somebody felt rejected. They felt rejected. Somebody felt like you were their soulmate. They're feeling that right now. Somebody feels like you're their soulmate. And um, if there's a male watching this, someone wants to open up something with you to have a new beginning, but it's going to start with casual sex. They're just going to assume that, you know, that's going to get you going. But please understand that this person here, I still would not, I wouldn't trust them. Choose wisely. You get to decide what you need to do, collective, but choose wisely, okay? Because there's Eight of Cups here underneath the Seven of Swords in the reverse. You already caught on to something, all right? And you have a lot of hope for the future, or you are very hopeful, or you're someone that gives this person hope or other people hope, and someone doesn't like that. If you have a following of some sort, if you started doing a hobby or something, or just anything in general, it could be a work situation as well. Somebody feels rejected by you. Okay, they feel rejected by you. So in turn, this person, when they feel rejected in any way, shape, or form, it doesn't have to be actually a commitment. This could be a friendship or anything. This Nine of Cups in Reverse and Page of Cups in Reverse. Someone acts out when they feel rejected in any way. Maybe there was one night or something that you, you were supposed to hang out with this female. And you were like, look, I got other plans they found out or saw some type of TikTok snap or something. You was hanging out with some other people. They're very much in this energy where they just feel like they need to make your life hell. And they feel like once they make their life hell, they'll be the last person standing. And they'll have a beautiful little rose sitting here to kiss your ass. Y'all better watch it. People are weird. There's people that are very weird. They might have seen you do something else and they felt rejected by you or some shit and stuff like that. They want to be you. I don't know why I'm getting. Somebody here wants to be somebody. Or somebody here wants to be... Um, maybe somebody here is jealous of your sibling or something because they get to have access to you. Maybe they'll cause you and your siblings to fight or something. Somebody here is just very nasty. I don't know why. And it's something that you may not know. It might be very much well hidden. And you may not know too much about it. Spirit, clarify that three of swords. And you may not know much about it. There's a lot going on in this reading. Restricted. Restricted. For the three of swords here. They feel like they're stuck in this emotional loss. They need to see something fall for you in some way, shape, or form. They feel that's going to bring it out. It's going to stop the pain they're feeling. 
this person just really doesn't clearly understand that they've screwed up more than once. And the way they feel to fix it is to screw up more. Some of you are dealing with a nut bag, I have to be honest. I'm not trying to be I'm not trying to be rude. Yeah, look at this. I can't make it up. At the bottom of my deck here it says foolish and there's a clown. Okay? There's a clown. There's a clown out there right now that sees you as a gift. All right? You see that? The gift right after the clown card. There's a clown out there that sees you as a gift, but they made a sacrifice. Okay, and let me tell you, it was not worth it. They sacrificed you, and now they're feeling the emotional loss and regrets and everything else. <sighs> Behind the um, sacrifice, we got karmic love. Maybe they act karmic, very jealous, very egotistical. Didn't I see the ego card over here? Yeah. Vanity, you got to look a certain way or whatnot to be around me. Somebody here, there's a female. Why have I been picking up female energy? Like my last reading I did, I did one for Taurus, and it was discussing like a mother figure, I believe. Okay, that was mistrust that you can't trust that somebody was manipulating some look, man. Look, not all females is like that. If there's a dude watching right now, you like, man, all women are the same. No, honey. If you a female right now, all men are the same. No, honey. That's not how that works. Okay, there's absolutely, absolutely beautiful soul people out there that are very kind, very loving, very respectful. It's just that a lot of people don't come from that. I don't know. This Ten of Pentacles here, but right above the Ace of Earth. I just feel like you're solid, Collective. I, I'm going to be honest. I'm not gassing you up. Not at all. No. I just feel like they, they're regretting because they see just how solid you are with this Ten of Pentacles energy. I just feel like it's solid. You're solid. You're somebody that you'll stick through thick and thin. And now you're loving yourself. It's a wrap. With that world card up underneath that, that's a wrap. It's over. So whatever they did here, <laughs> maybe somebody's already came and tried to come towards you to ask you to have some type of commitment and you rejected them. And they just, they, this person goes from being mad, sad, hateful, mad, angry, you know, confused. They feel rejected. They feel... You know, they got hurt you and do I don't mean hurt you physically. I'm not feeling that energy. I'm just feeling like they need to they need to make sure you in some way, shape, or form are rejected by other people because you rejected them in some way, shape, or form. Just be mindful who you're dealing with. Okay? Spirit spirit made it very clear here. Choose wisely. Look at all the different hands pointing in different directions. Okay? Because you get to make the decision. Alright? You get to make the decision. Triumph and success. Okay, right after the choose wisely. All right. And then we have suffering in silence. You got somebody here that have an emotion. They feel the emotional loss. Okay. And they're suffering in silence because they made a sacrifice. They made a sacrifice which caused a big, a big transformation and ending here. And that's where love begins. You loving your damn self. That's where that starts to begin. When you start seeing people's true colors and stuff. Start closing out things. Start loving on yourself. Things start transforming for you. I got some random cards I got out here. Facing and accepting. Okay? Facing and accepting is one. All right? Stalking you and anyone around you. I told y'all, somebody wants to be you or they want to be somebody around you that you're close to. I'm not making this stuff up. Okay? To persevere is power. So maybe at one point you felt rejected or maybe you felt some type of way. Maybe this separation or... Maybe this is going to happen. Maybe you've been feeling this energy and things are about, you're about to part ways with someone or something. You're going to persevere. You're going to be powerful. Okay. You're going to be powerful. You're going to find individuals and things that are going to appreciate you and stuff. And there's going to be some female that ain't going to like that. They want to tarnish your reputation and cause it to go down to sink. Okay. Because they couldn't, they going to regret it. They, if they're not going to regret now, unblock me. Yes. <laughs> Look at it, look at it, look at it. What do, they need, what do they need you to unblock them for when they're already spying on your ass from different accounts? I feel that energy too. Because somebody here is watching you do something and they're feeling regret, remorse, and all this and that. They, they're they trying to find a way to beat you with a non-loyal, uncommit, uncommitted ass. <laughs> I'm sorry, collective, come on now. Y'all done, Lord, you need to get out your feelings. You just bring the call. Why are you acting all like that? Come on, man. Come on. Because I can feel the 
the the the the b the bs is just like floating from the table it's just like get that out of here okay <laughs> Oh, man. Yo. I ain't like the other readers, honey, okay? I don't know. I'm gonna sell. Spirit, give me three cards, please, to close the reading out. Thank you so much for blessing the reading. Those of you that feel like this did not wear, um, did not, um, resonate with you, okay? My apologies, but this is the message that I got. I hope that you come by next time, and we'll see if we got anything for you. All right, I pray for all of you. I hope that you have a beautiful day. Keep loving yourself. Be faithful to yourself. Be cheerful, happy, all right? Okay, just try not to dwell on old things. We have time. Time. On this card, it says broken, damaged. So somebody probably spent a lot of time damaging a connection that they didn't think they were going to need anymore. And they want to, there's a female that wants a new beginning. They feel they want some type of opening opening up with something here. They want you to open the door again or something to maybe they'll start off saying, let's have some casual, happy intimacy, happy endings and whatever. And yeah, I don't know. Conflicts and tension. Okay. Conflicts and tension. Yeah. Somebody's conflicted here. And then we have the last card here collected, Peachy King Satisfaction. I think you're doing just fine without somebody that causes conflict and tension in your life. A lot of time has went by and this person's just continued to allow things to stay broken because they got some type of ego trip. And unfortunately, they're going to be rejected. Some of you are going to reject this person when they come back asking you for a commitment. But see, it's something selfish here with this nine of cups in reverse and this page of cups in the reverse. Somebody here is just a bit conniving. All right. Lauren, oh my gosh, just smile. Why are all your readings so negative, honey? The world is beautiful. But the world is also dark. Yes. I'm just happy Spirit gives me the energy and gives me the messages to give the messages to those that need them. So if this resonated with you, give a thumbs up. If it didn't resonate, give a thumbs up still. Give some love to the channel. Whether you like me or you don't, babe. Thank you so much for stopping by. I love you guys and I will definitely see you in the next video. Mwah, mwah. Bye, guys.